Ian, coming towards the end of the second full week of pre-season, how's it been so far? Great, really enjoyed it. I think the lads have really took, taken good care of themselves in, in the off-season. Um, quality and standard of the training has been exceptional. Um, we're in a good place and everyone's in one piece, which is important, and we're looking forward to Saturday. At this stage, what does pre-season look like? What sort of things have the lads been doing in the first couple of weeks? Mostly running. Uh, unfortunately, as I keep telling them, you have to run to play football and to play the football the way we want to play, high, te high intensity in and out possession, you have to be fit. Uh, so they've worked really hard, but they have embraced it and, and done really well. Um, the football work has taken more, you know, longer this, this week, we've done it more, um, progressed the training up, progressed the sessions, uh, back into 11-11 again. Um, so we're ready for Saturday, you know, we're excited that we've got our first game in front of fans um, and we can't wait. A lot of hours on the training ground for the lads in the first couple of weeks, double session, running, ball work, but I guess all that time is spent together, that's going to help the new lads settle in particular. Yeah, as I said, we, we, we're in a different place to last season because we've got continuity, we've got um, a foundation that we can build from and we've picked players to come in and add to what we already have. Um, they all seem to have settled really quickly, the, the old lads have, have made them feel really welcome, uh, they're enjoying the football, they're enjoying what we do and yeah, hopefully we can see the fruits of that this Saturday. And how have the new lads been getting on? Have you been impressed with what you've seen from them so far out on the grass? They've done great. They've done great, um, you know, they've found it hard and I think some of them have, have understood the change in intensity from what they've been used to at the other clubs they've been at, but they're, they're getting used to it quickly and they, as I said they're enjoying it, um, they can see that they've got some good players around them and we'll know more once the proper game's kicking. The group as a whole, a lot of hard work's gone in, how, how are they looking at the minute the group? Yeah, I mean they're looking fit first and foremost. They're all in one piece, which is important. We try and avoid injuries. You know, we have to monitor the data to make sure we're not overloading them and try and avoid muscle injuries at all costs. Some of the injuries we can't avoid, you know, contact ones, that's just the nature of the beast. But the muscular ones, we can do what we can to try and avoid them. Um, yeah, they're, they're looking forward to playing. You know, that's, once the football starts, we'll find out where we're at. Yeah, pre-season's tough for players. A lot of work goes in. I'd imagine after two weeks of what's probably been hard graft, they are looking forward to getting back on the grass and just playing a game of 11 aside football. Yeah, that, that's exactly it. And I think, you know, George is looking forward to Saturday. Um, obviously, George you know, learned a lot of his trade there, um, started there. And it's nice for him to go back there and, and think about how far he's come in a short space of time. Um, so, yeah, we're, we're excited to have our fans there as well. You know, to have 500 or so fans there, maybe more, that I don't know. Um, will be great for the players because we've not had that yet. It's a really busy schedule as well. When you look at it, it's pretty much Saturday and the midweek all the way right up to the first game of the season. How yeah. important do you think it is to have that busy schedule, especially when you've got sort of 30 plus lads in the team? Yeah, I mean, early on we'll have to manage the minutes. Um, be probably more like two 45 minutes, two different teams each half. Um, but as we progress through pre-season, we'll give the lads longer and longer and longer getting used to playing 90 minute football matches again and everything's you know, geared towards MK Dons on the 7th of August.